it's a platform for national conversation. If they are not allowed to go abroad for medical treatment, they will be forced to do something about the institutions here. And every word at this event is geared towards preparing an actionable solution to build in a Nigeria that works. When the nation works, it works for every single one of us. Every single one. The rich, the poor, the old, the young, the one in the village, the one in the city. Wherever we are, the ones that live in the diaspora will work with a little more gate because they can have the pride of place of saying, I come from a great place, a great nation, and that nation is Nigeria. I don't need a cover to cover the color of my passport. I can proudly show that it's green. And it's not the green of another country. It's the green passport of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Some of the speakers say they're already walking the talk, asking more Nigerians to come on board. We are highly import dependent. That is why I chose to dress this way today. The fabric may not be made in Nigeria, but the person that put it together is in Nigeria. That's value created here. The shoes I'm wearing made in Nigeria. Maybe the only thing you take out is my wristwatch. But even my cufflinks were designed here in Nigeria. Because it carries my initials. That's Nigerian content. So for everything you buy that is made here, you are creating jobs in Nigeria. But for every important thing you buy, you are creating jobs abroad. You know, the finest moment for any nation has always been when entrepreneurs rise. Nigeria has some of the finest in the world. But the challenge we have is that because the educational system is still a paralysis, they are not prepared for them to execute at the upstream level. And for you to move from the downstream to the upstream, you need a huge accumulation of capability which the university system has to give you. Decent, well the platform we started 12 years ago holds twice a year.